Hey, Joe, thanks for coming in. I appreciate you sharing uh, some time with us today. Tell us how you ended up at Hardin Simmons. Well, um, my senior year of high school, I took a tour here. My counselor actually graduated from here. Uh, it was a wonderful tour, had a great experience. Uh, we found his name on the alumni wall. Oh, cool. So it was very personal to him, and I could tell how much the school made a difference to him. And so uh, that seeing his experience and how it affected him made it really personal for me to want to come here. You're very involved in campus. I see you everywhere. <laughs> Give us just a short list of everything that you're in. Uh, I always forget some stuff, but uh, so I'm a worship major. Jeez, I'm on the chapel band. I'm in our choir. I'm in the cowboy band. I work for media. I'm an RA now. Uh, I was a part of our Dungeons and Dragons club whenever we had it. We're working on trying to get stuff out, but I'd got way too much going on to sure. try to start that myself. Um, hopefully I'll be in a couple other music related uh, jazz band. We're considering starting Upbeat soon, so that'll be fun to be a part of. And as per Dr. Spangler, I'm an unofficial theater minor. <laughs> okay, good. Um, so I'm a little bit of everything. You are a typical Hardin Simmons student, which is <laughs> incredibly busy. How do you get it all done? Uh, it's a really big balance. Uh, making sure I have time set apart for everything that I do. Uh, luckily, the school does a really good job of making sure stuff is scheduled to where it won't conflict with um, your regular schedule. I've, Other than theater, because uh, theater is its own little thing, I haven't had anything actually conflict with my schedule. Everything's been planned out from the start, and hardly ever does it get in the way of something else. So. That's good. What do you love about Hardin Simmons faculty? Uh, faculty are great. I. Absolutely love how open they are to having conversations. They're not just uh, like teachers aren't just there to teach, but they're there for interpersonal community, uh, interpersonal connections. Um, and then the staff that aren't teachers that a lot of people don't always give the full credit, like the cafeteria workers, all the like all the bosses for media and like RA jobs that I'm part of both of. Like they're not just there as faces for, hey, I'm the boss of this, but they want to get to know you. They're, they're more than just their job. And I, I think they go into a really good job of making sure that people know, hey, we're not just here to do this and then go home, but we want to be there for the students. We're here for the students. What do you want to do in life? What's the, what's the next stage after graduation? Um, my hopes are, <laughs> there's one of three things that I've decided. It's either uh, be a worship pastor specifically at a church, be a youth pastor that focuses on part of the worship, or be a worship artist. Those are my Very cool. three hopeful, but uh, I always, usually when people ask, I just say, I'm just going wherever God takes me. That's good. A lot of us are, are just like that. It's <laughs> wherever he, he wants us to go. Uh, any favorite vacations you can remember with your family or friends? Uh, the one, always, um, one that always comes to mind, we took a trip to, uh, I think it was West Virginia, uh, I had some extended family living up there, and so on our way there, we stopped at Myrtle Beach in South Carolina. Mm. Was had a great time at the beach, and then Metropolis, Illinois, went to um, see all the Superman exhibit stuff that was out there. It was an experience, and I think we went to Medieval Times. Uh, it's the only time I can actually remember going to Medieval Times, so my only time being out of state was kind of a, a cool experience. but. This was easily over 10 years ago, and I still remember it, so it That's had to have some importance in my mind. That's good. Well, I appreciate you coming in and sharing your story and sharing a little bit about your life.